How is a rainbow made? Why do dogs chase cats? Why do cats chase birds, but they eat fish? Why can't parrots talk but other birds can't? Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way. What's up YouTube? It's your boy, Mexican Thor here. I got a special guest, my little cousin Natalie. We're here to do a little Q&A video for you guys. Um, basically, just ask you guys questions about certain things and just to see what you guys think or if you guys know the answers to. I don't know. We don't know. But, yeah. First, uh, make sure you guys, uh, if you're not subscribed, uh, make sure you smash the like button and comment down below and to show, show me some love. So we're gonna get started with uh, this first question. And first, I'd like to apologize for the loudness in the background and the little kid crying. He's not with us, but yeah, uh, first question is, I want to know from you guys is, how is everybody doing um, now that everything is, you know, reopening re and, you know, with this whole COVID-19 thing, see how people uh, are basically doing, you know, staying safe, washing your hands, wearing masks and stuff like that. Comment down below, let me know how you guys are doing. That's the first thing I want to kind of know about you guys. So, uh, leave us a message. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Okay, guys, question number two is, are you guys excited that everything's opening? Because I know everybody is tired of being inside. Yeah, everyone's been tired of being inside, locked up like uh like a caged animal or something and um yeah we're just you know tired of being locked up basically i mean i know i'm tired but you guys already know that me and the, sh and the chef out there are always going out anyways making uh for you guys but, yeah just comment down below and let us know what you guys think of uh, my little cousin's question the third question is, are you guys excited to go in and dine in at other places? Because I know I am. I've been waiting for this place to dine in this place right here. This is my favorite place to be at. Borrow's Pizza. They got the best pizza that I know of in town. But yeah, that's the third question. Um, what, what do you guys think or feel about, you know, being able to dine in now? I mean, this whole curbside thing is uh, it's a good idea but by the time you get home and eat it it's the food gets cold or you know you forget something or I don't know. just comment down and let me know uh, what you guys think about you know dining in a lot of places number four, number four. is um where do you guys plan on going when everything like when everything reopens well i personally want to go to the mall I'm go swimming, but my mom is too worried. Like she thinks that I'm gonna get sick, so I really can't go out nowhere besides to the stores and things. So, yeah. Yeah, just comment. What do you guys think about our question about where are you guys are gonna go when now that everything is opening up? That's a good idea, the mall. We've been waiting to go to the mall for a good while now too been closed locked up 
but yeah, don't mind us. We're just enjoying our lunch. Pretty good, man. I mean, now the fifth question is what do you guys think about basically about this whole COVID 19 stuff? I know a lot of people are still concerned that just because things are opening that it's going to be over. I Personally, I think it's not going to be over. It's still going to be going around. So it's still got to be safe. More and more people are starting to get sick. So I think they should have, they shouldn't have open, reopened Arizona, but at the same time they should have because the population is going down. And plus the weather too is changing, the climate. Yeah. It's getting really, really hot here. Way hotter. It shouldn't even be hot right now. But it's getting super hot. But yeah, just comment below. Let let us know. The sixth question is how how is our place quarantine going? How's your quarantine going? Mine was going pretty good. I mean, I got to stay at home more to you know play around with my grandson and you know spend more time with him and my family and sometimes it would get boring but sometimes it would be fun and I don't know I still go out and make yeah, hot bangers you guys already know that so yeah everything's been good just uh can't wait to go back to work too so, what about yours mine was pretty boring um all I did was clean via my phone do tiktok <laughs> That's it. Mm -hmm. That's basically what everybody is, was doing. Staying home, staying safe. But still, you know, you still need to go out and get some supplies, whatever stuff you guys really need. But, yeah. Or I would go out and get snacks to watch movies with the, the family or something. Just yeah. something simple. To not, like, be bored. To just, like, keep me... How is it? Productive during this quarantine. And how about school? What do you think about all this school on the laptop and stuff? Oh, it's, it's, it's hard. It's hard, really, it is. It's more harder than being in regular school because there's like a lot of internet towards it. So I don't know how people that have to do <clears throat> online school, how they do it because it's confusing. But other than that, I passed. I'm going to the eighth grade. So. Mm. That's good. That's good. Very good. Uh, also, too, I want to congratulate all the 2020 graduates. Uh, that's including my my uh, cousin Carmen. Uh, she graduated this year, so congratulations to her and everybody else that graduated. So, yeah, basically, guys, this is the video we're doing. Short video, just letting you guys know, like, ask all these questions and, you know, seeing what you guys think. Don't forget to comment down below, smash the like button, and, you know, hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. Uh, so that way you guys will be notified when I do more videos more content so and also if you guys have TikTok or snapchat or what's the other one people look at instagram you guys go ahead and check out uh my little cousins uh she has TikTok, snapchat and instagram her TikTok is what's here natalie acosta six six nine 693. And then her Snapchat is? Natalie underscore 110650065. And her Instagram is? Natalie dot So go check her out and show her some love and appreciation and stuff for the stuff that she's doing. And um, yeah, pretty much. Just you guys stay safe. Um, keep wearing your masks. Uh, wash, wash your hands. hands. Use that stuff. What is that stuff hand called? Sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. Don't and touch. Don't touch anything yeah. that's supposed to. 
before you go, before you go out, put hand sanitizer on. When you get back, wash your hands because you never know what other people touch. So basically, yeah, just stay safe. Message. And um, I'm telling you guys, we're just gonna keep on putting on hot bangers. Don't forget to check out the homies channel, the Fat Mexican Chef, and his other channel, Cooking with the Fat Mexican Chef. And um, yeah, we're just gonna be putting out more videos for you guys. And um, also, uh, this is gonna be new. I know you guys always see, you know, the Queen Chef, uh, Junior Chef, and Mini Chef. Uh, you might be seeing my little cousin Natalie in my videos even more, and maybe in my Mexican Chef videos. But uh, it all depends, you know. I gotta ask my my cousin, her mom, if she can go with me to do these videos and stuff like that. Because I know she wants her to be safe, but who better to be safe when it's the Mexican Thor? <laughs> but yeah, you guys just keep on watching, um, and don't forget to check out. Um, the homies channel he's gonna be putting out a video probably Tuesday or Wednesday so uh, yeah just check us out and show us more love anything else make sure you like and subscribe and share the video that way everybody can get more fans and just you know, stay safe and don't get the wrong <laughs> But yeah, anyways, I'm the Mexican Thor. This is my channel. You're my fans. Peace. One hour later. Okay, Natalie? Yeah. If a cat is inside and he goes outside, is he an outside cat? If the outside cat goes inside, does he become an inside cat? I don't know. What do you guys think? Very hard question. Hmm. Okay, what if an outside dog goes outside and an inside? Yeah, an inside dog goes outside and an outside dog goes inside. Are they considered an outside and an inside dog? I don't know. Hmm. What, do you, what do you guys think? It's a very hard question. If a fish is in a tank, and you put him in the ocean, is he an ocean fish? And if the ocean fish gets put in a tank, is he a regular fish? I don't know. Those are very hard questions. They're weird questions, but I don't know. They're hard questions. Just let us know. We don't know. Yeah, we're just gonna eat. We're just gonna sit here and Pizza. Need pizza. That's about it.